In 1881, the Japanese first began keeping records of earthquakes around the world. Recording of earthquakes has become common, as many countries use seismometers and then install advanced seismic stations. In the 2000s, with the advancement of technology, earthquakes around the world can be detected instantly and recorded in digital environments. Hundreds of thousands of earthquakes occur around the world each year. While some of these earthquakes are so low that they cannot be felt by humans, some of them can cause disasters with the destruction they cause. The island of Sumatra, in northern Indonesia, was hit by another 8.6 magnitude earthquake in 2005, following the major earthquake in 2004. Giant waves from the earthquake, which killed more than 1,300 people, reached Sri Lanka and injured more than 400 people. Although known as the Assam earthquake, the earthquake, whose epicenter is thought to be Tibet, took place in 1950 with a magnitude of 8.6. Many cities, districts and towns in China, Tibet and India were affected by this natural disaster that occurred in the terrestrial area and lost 780 people's lives. An 8.7 magnitude earthquake was recorded in 1965 off Alaska's Rat Islands. Most of the damage after the earthquake was caused by the tsunami. There was no loss of life in the earthquake, which caused minor damage. The 8.8 .8 magnitude earthquake that struck Ecuador and Colombia in 1906 caused the death of more than a thousand people in both countries. The tsunami that occurred after the earthquake crossed the ocean and reached Japan. It took approximately 12 hours for the tsunami to cross the Pacific Ocean. Chile experienced another 8.8 .8 earthquake in 2010 that lasted for 1.5 minutes. The earthquake that struck the city of Concepcion killed more than 700 people. About a third of the country's coasts were damaged by the tsunami, and tsunami warnings were issued in more than 50 countries. While electricity was cut in almost all of Chile, 2 million people were affected by the earthquake and 500,000 houses were badly damaged. The magnitude of the earthquake that occurred in eastern Russia in 1952 was 9.0. The Kamchatka region, where the earthquake took place, is located at the northern end of the Pacific Ring of Fire, where earthquake plates are located between the continents of Australia, Asia and the Americas and where seismic activities are experienced frequently. According to the authorities, 2,336 people lost their lives in the region consisting of 6,000 people while the tremors were felt even in the Hawaiian Islands. Japan, one of the countries with the most earthquakes in the world, encountered the largest earthquake in its history in 2011. Strong tsunami waves triggered by the earthquake in the Tohoku region of Japan increased up to 40.5 meters and were effective in an area of 10 kilometers from the coast to the inside. The leak at the Fukushima nuclear power plant and led to the largest nuclear disaster since the Chernobyl disaster. The earthquake and the subsequent tsunami resulted in the loss or disappearance of more than 20,000 people. The earthquake that occurred on the Indonesian island of Sumatra in 2004 lasted about 10 minutes and was recorded as the longest earthquake recorded in the world. The earthquake, which caused the world to tremble by one centimeter and triggered other earthquakes up to Alaska, affected 14 countries. The earthquake, in which approximately 230,000 people lost their lives and 1 million people became homeless, is considered one of the natural disasters that caused the most deaths. The 9.2 magnitude earthquake that occurred in Alaska in 1964 was recorded as the second strongest earthquake ever to be measured. The earthquake, which lasted for three minutes, created giant tsunami waves with the seafloor rising 10 meters. Despite the earthquake's intensity, only 128 people lost their lives because it took place in Alaska, one of the most sparsely populated areas in the world. It caused more than $300 million in damage. The Great Chilean Earthquake is the largest earthquake of all time measured on the Richter scale. The tsunami, which was formed as a result of the earthquake and reached a height of 10 meters, 
spread over an area of 10,000 kilometers and reached Japan and the Philippines. It is estimated that the number of people who died due to the earthquake exceeded 2,000 people. Puyehue Volcano, located in the south of the country, remained active for weeks due to the effect of the earthquake that caused $550 million of damage in Chile.